Hey, what's going on survivors? The first patch for Forever Sky should be dropping soon and I got some juicy details on some of the things we can expect to see when it does drop. So the devs have been busy dropping some sneak peeks over the last week or so for what we can expect on the first patch to hit the game sometime in July. And I gotta say, so far it is looking pretty good. In their first tweet in late June, they said that the patch should include some bug fixes, improvements, and as well as some new content. So let's take a look at what they've revealed so far. As part of our upcoming patch, we've been making changes to inventory management, increasing its size by 25%. Extractable item stacks have increased from 50 to 100. Picked up item stacks have increased from 20 to 25, and rare pickup items like crystal batteries have increased from 5 to 10. But that's not all. We've also increased the number of slots from the small storage box and hanging shelves. You can see those both down below. You got the backpack and the hanging shelf, and it looks like they've added an additional six slots to the hanging shelf, which is actually pretty nice. Changes are also coming to the auto extractor in the upcoming patch, giving players more control. Be able to filter what resources you collect, assign up to four containers for one resource, and save power by turning the extractor off when it's not needed. That's actually pretty nice because that thing is pretty beast new colors for your paint tool, as well as an automatic bridge for some of you that have gigantic air bases. That's all the latest news for now, but make sure you hit that subscribe button to stay up to date on all the latest guides, news, and everything to do with Forever Skies. I'm Granddaddy Gamer. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time.